In just the last week, three credit card skimmer devices have been found in the Queen City. The first at the Walmart on Gold Street, discovered by a loss prevention employee during a routine terminal check on March 23rd. Started to look back at surveillance video and noticed on March 16th that there was a male that was by that terminal and you could see him pull it out of his pocket, quickly snap it on, make a purchase and then leave the store. Police are working to identify a potential suspect seen on that surveillance video. Two similar skimmers were discovered at 7-Elevens on Beach Street and then Maple Street, found two days apart. The skimmer stuck right on top of the existing terminals. It was actually customers had been complaining that pressing the buttons was a little bit difficult. James Gorman, an information security expert, tells News 9 the card information can be collected in one of two ways. Lots of times it will store it right there on an SD card in the skimmer, or they could use it like a low-power Wi-Fi or a low-power Bluetooth to send it off to somewhere else. Gorman says you are better protected if using a credit card with a chip in it. And in most cases, if making a debit transaction, the criminals would also need to see you enter your PIN to gain access to your bank account. Most surface skimmers don't collect the PIN entry. Still, customers of the stores in question should check their bank and credit card statements daily. They should be moderately concerned. I wouldn't say they should be extremely concerned, and I don't think they should ignore it. The Manchester police are investigating the three incidents separately, but they haven't heard of any customers being victimized. They are asking merchants in the city to inspect their card terminals daily. Live in Manchester, Jason King, WMUR News 9.